muted. Just, just unmute yourself. You know, one of the things I, you know, must talk about a lot is the continuity of doing inner work. You know, doing it and making a commitment to do it. You know, uh, really, basically, everyone should make a commitment to sit down every day and work on themselves, come to classes, you know, and not create these huge gaps you know, of absence, you know, where your energy gets eaten up, you get consumed by life. And, you know, I mean, I always say it, a car has to go into a filling station in order to get gasoline to run. You know, refrigerators need electricity, you know? I mean, I, we need energy. We need Shakti. We need to replace what we spend every day. You know, and that's what these classes are for to replace what we spend every day and to make a commitment to be there, to attend. You know, I mean, yes, I know people go through very difficult situations with relatives, with, you know, whatever, but there's always an hour a day that one can use to sit down and refill their tanks. Because it's important. I mean, we, you know, we have to live with ourselves every day. And truthfully, you know, life consumes a lot of energy. Relatives, friendships, the way we work, our activities during the day, it all consumes energy. We need to replace that energy. And, you know, I mean, again, one has to make that commitment. I can't feel myself get drained dry. I mean, you know, you think it's easy for me to attend seven of these classes a week, <laughs> eight, you know, it's not easy. But my chemistry requires it. I need it. And yes, I will periodically take a vacation. But there's the commitment to understanding that if I don't refill the Shakti, the energy, it will eventually drain dry. And then people function on mind, tension, tension, more tension. Now that's what fuels their lives. And also, that energy also consumes people. You know, it's not that I... Look, I don't need disciples. I don't need all of that stuff. You know, what I'm looking for is the commitment to build a spiritual life, you know, so this work can be passed on to people. And it's always apparent to me when somebody you know, skips a few weeks of classes and they come in there. You know, you can see that the energy is not working right. They're in their heads, they're drained, they're... And it shouldn't be that way because the universe, God, whatever you want to... has made this available to all of us. Rudy made this available to all of us. I'm trying to make this available to everybody that comes here. I mean, if you have better things to do, that's all right. It's your life. I'm not here to boss you around and tell you how to live. You know? But I am here to say this is here. And 
everyone here knows about it and should take advantage of it. Does anyone have a question I would like? I mean, last week for me was a particularly hard week. And going through what I had to go through last week, I was so grateful to be able to sit down and do my inner work. And it wasn't easy to do the inner work. I had to overcome a lot of different situations in myself. But it was worth the effort to overcome them and to truly, you know, tap that higher energy to replace what was being consumed in me. And again, I'm not here to control people's lives. I'm really not. You do your life. You know, whatever is essential and important and a priority, you do it. All I'm here to say is that there, these classes are available. And nobody is consumed by the external world 24 hours a day. You can always find an hour to sit down and work on yourself. And what life does to us should be a reminder that we have to find that hour to sit down and work on ourselves. Does anyone have a question to ask? I mean, that to me, it's funny. That's the best reminder that you better sit down and do something, life itself. <laughs> like we have to go through every day in order to, you know, take care of the rent and the food and the this and that and work. It should be an absolute reminder. Sit down and work inside yourself. There's no better reminder. And instead of being an excuse not to do it, it should be an excuse, hey, I got to sit down and work on myself. I'm getting depleted here by all the stuff that's going. Does anyone have a question? Again, if anyone's interested, we're having a retreat next month on the 19th. You're all welcome. Does anyone have a question we'd like to? Okay, there'll be a class on Tuesday. Thank you. As I always say, all of you are here to teach me something. You know, I learn every class I come to, and every class is a reminder to me that I have to come back and continue to do these classes because they truly are building a system in myself, you know, that is essential to connect with God. So I have nothing but gratitude to all of you. And I just kind of spoke today because I hope people take advantage of what is being put in their lives. I really do. It works, for God's sake. Okay, if there are no questions, then God bless you all. Thank you. And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing everyone on Tuesday. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.